This is my favorite tree. It's a mimosa tree that I planted about seven years ago. The bumblebees love it, the hummingbirds love it. It looks great all summer long. It's just been a really nice tree. So imagine my surprise after a week at the beach and we come back to this. I was thinking about what a drag it's going to be to tear that out of the ground and replace it. My buddy Brad, who knows a thing or two about trees, said, let's try and save it. He gave me some ideas and I got to work. So first I whacked a bunch off of it to help it lose weight, give it some strength. Then I started raising it up and closing the gap, first with the truck and then with a hand winch. If I had a tractor, I'd just pick the thing up. But the neighbors are not around at this moment. I fashioned these out of stainless steel using 3 8 threaded rod. Okay, I'm very happy with this. There's a bolt on the one side going through about 18 inches up from the bottom. And then I got a second one right at the joint where it split. And then some eye bolts and a turnbuckle up here a little bit further. And as you can see, I've got the gap down to, oh, eighth quarter of an inch. Please mind the and gap. And I'm going to continue tightening Please it up a little bit the gap. every day. And I'm going to, um, I'm going to treat it with a fungicide a couple of times before I paint it with that black tar stuff. So all in all, Brad, I thank you for giving me the inspiration to save my tree. Yeah, it looks a little chopped off there, but what are you going to do? And I should have chopped do? more of that off, I suppose. But um, anyway, thank you.